transplant diagnostics in that industry. What exactly does that mean? And why is that stock so optimistically pricing in your future prospects? Dominic, thank you so much for having me this morning. We focus on transplantation from the beginning, matching an organ to a recipient, all the way to caring for the transplantation patient after transplant throughout the lifetime of the patient. So our story of applying sequencing technology to a very specific therapeutic area, the field of transplantation, is a very exciting story, and we're only in the beginning. So, so this is a genetics story. This is about trying to figure out the, the best possible way for an organ transplant to be matched and fully functioning for a patient throughout the course of a hopefully long life. Absolutely. DNA sequencing is so important when you're matching an organ to a recipient. And then after transplantation, you need to monitor the immune system on a constant basis because your body tries to reject the foreign organ. So you're on constant immune suppressive medication. In order to monitor that, you need DNA sequencing analysis. And that's what we do with our lead product now in kidney transplantation, Allosure. All right, so, so it, it's not to make this seem callous at all, but we, we often talk about things like subscription as a service, you know, a longer term recurring stream. Does that then mean that your business is geared more towards at least a patient's lifetime or life cycle? And is there a revenue stream because of that? Absolutely, it is a recurring revenue stream, but much more important for us is obviously that we are monitoring these patients throughout the lifetime of the patient. Our product, uh, when we did the development, leads to seven allosures in the first year and then four in the second and four in the third. That's where we have the clinical data right now. That's the clinical study that we continue to do with our registry study. We are including a thousand patients in 50 transplant centers already today in the United States. Peter, Peter, what's the next step for your company? I, I mean, obviously, investors have been very optimistic given that run-up in your shares. What exactly are you looking to deliver to investors in the future to justify some of that run-up that we've seen over the course of the past few months? Obviously, we're very early with Allosure. It's only a 3% penetration. We have a long way to go. In heart transplantation, we already care for about 30% of all heart transplant patients in the United States with our product, Allomap. And so we're setting the watermark with heart transplantation, and we try to mimic that with kidney transplantation. But then sequencing te technology is so much bigger and transplantation medicine is so much bigger because there's an ever need increasing for transplantation medicine.